all right welcome back guys it's soul soup in here and today i'm playing more um pe pele lune plenty loon plenty loon bro i will never be able to pronounce the name of this game <laughs> right for the life of me bro so i'm just gonna call it lune so they added two more classes since the last time i played and yeah so let's get into it so first i suppose i'm going to be using sword swayer it is a what, what are my vibes from this i'm getting genshin impact you know what i'm talking about i put up put, i put it up on the screen now of uh, the player like just like having a sword on their back that's floating from the looks of it it might be very interesting i'm not quite sure Okay. I don't know. I, I kind of don't really like the idea of like a sword being swung with my mind, if that makes sense. It's like I'm not actually swinging the sword. I'm just waving my hand and it's, it's just a weird feeling. M might not be the class for me, but yeah. And low-key, this was kind of like a silent update, not gonna lie, like, I didn't- like, Why didn't they put this, like, new classes or something in the title of the game? To get more players. You know what I mean? It's like miss potential right there. Okay, that seems a bit OP, not gonna cap. That move is kind of, kind of broken, like I just said. Ooh, nice. Okay, I like it how like they're blocking now. Oh, I just broke that guy's hand. All right, uh, GG's. Okay, so first fight, I'm not really a fan of it. I'm gonna be honest. It's a cool idea. Definitely, and I can see people enjoying it, but the idea of me being like off the ground like this kind of like mess up my perception of like running around so someone. Does that make sense? Like not having like the run around animation with your feet and you being floating off the ground. But uh, ne uh, nonetheless, it is a creative class, that's for sure. I don't think I've seen anything like this in any other like battleground game. So yep, I guess we'll try out the next class called Contract. Okay, so this appears to just be like a gun. So this is just like, um, that, uh, what am I call it? Morpho, I think. The one where you turn into like the fairy gun, gun guy. But this one appears to be not related to that class at all. And, uh, someone also made the, not the, not the reference, but the correction that this class is from, which one, what class? It was Alfiel? Nope. Catalyst? Nope. This one. This one is um, Roland from, um, I think, was that like an anime series or something? Anyways, but thanks for making that correction. But still, I promise you, there's an ability in Peroxide we're using this exact same sword. Anywho, let's go back to using Contract and get into our first fight, shall we? Seems like we got a lot of weird characters in this game. And I guess, I think this is a new thing over here. I wasn't really paying attention last time I was playing, but I think they added some emotes as well. Yeah, I think I think this is new, yeah. That's new, okay. Server list, okay. I think I'm, what's it, Greedy Leo? Okay. I'm still looking for someone to fight, but I just wanted to, you know, say something on that. So yeah, let's look for someone to fight. Okay, so first things first, I'm noticing that the M1s are definitely a bit strange. Oh, wow. Yeah, I can see why that guy didn't want to fight this class. Oh. This 
this guy might just be that skilled though, so the imbalances of this class might just be nothing compared to this guy. Oh! Loki, this guy's just kind of keep like somehow I'm losing in the range department. Like what? That makes no sense. My whole thing is have a gun. What does that even do? Wow. Okay. GG. That was um interesting for sure. Reason being like. Somehow I was losing in the range department against that class. Okay, I kind of just shot those off. But to even use your abilities, you have to be like close to people. What in the? Did they add new abilities? What is that? I think they added new abilities to that class. Anyways, I don't know why they didn't say like they updated and added some new classes to the game. Like, that would have definitely gotten some players. Or maybe they did, and I just didn't wasn't looking at this game at the time. But they should have definitely left that new class in the title for a bit. They added two new characters. Two new characters. I don't even know if anyone knew. But, yeah. Um, let's continue the showcase. Loki, the most unstructured showcase of all time. One. Okay, so you... A bar barrage of bullets, as it says. Silent bullet. I don't know if this is like adding like a stats effect to people. Full M1 combo here. Okay. Three. Inevitable bullet. Okay. Do these these uh, abilities look like they're going to do something new, but they're just doing the same thing? The low key just appears to be like the same ability over and over again. So, what is this from? Is this also from like the same universe as Roland? Or is this like some other anime type thing? It's very interesting. It's a very uh, good looking model though. I'll say that. I'll let him have the dummy if he wants it. As I'm looking, does ability three pull the person into you? Why would you want someone to come closer to you as a as a ranged user? Why would you want that? That just seems like you're just asking to put down. I mean, sure, you can M1 them with your gun itself, but like, it just seems to be like the the wrong idea for an ability. I think the inevitable bullet, if hit, that uh, stun locks someone as well. I'm not sure. I already have like a friend or like a dummy that can tell me this information. And also, so that's pretty much the end of the video, but I have some suggestions for the developers if they, you know, happen to stumble across this video. You guys should really add like uh, duels. You know what I mean? I think that would also help because I'm trying to look for people to fight and Loki, I'm not trying to like intervene on other people's fights. So it's hard to find people to fight. So it would help if there were duels, but I'm sure you'll get to doing that since you guys added emotes. Uh, that's a new feature from last time. And also, why didn't you guys put new classes in the title? That feels like such a missed opportunity for more players. Or is it just me being like a, a, a critic here? But anyways, if you found out about these new classes from this video, consider dropping a sub and a like. Thanks for watching. Okay, so I forgot to actually review the Sword Swayer abilities on a dummy. So here we go. M1 chain. Okay. Ability one. Ability two. Ability three. And ability four. That's it for the video. Thanks for watching.